Okay, so here's the pec release. I'm going to just place the end of my stick against the ground and I've got a ball on the end. You can also just have a uh, lacrosse ball or trigger ball and lean against something like a squat rack. Just place it between you and the rack and have pressure there, but I like having it on the end of a stick. Um, you can get these from Bunnings, any hardware store. Okay, so from here, you're just gonna dig it inside the crease of the shoulder. So if this is the crease, we're gonna work on the pec, so a little bit inside of that. You can hold it with the opposite hand and then you can start to do a little bit of movement with the free hand, working on gliding the tissues around and over the ball. You can even work taking the hand behind the back, work a little bit into the upper chest, a little bit lower. Imagine you're bench pressing, imagine you're reaching to pick something up, reaching overhead. Just explore all of these movements and finding any tissues that feel a little bit knotted a little bit gross and if you find something knotted or gross then just stop there breathe and hang out there for about 30 seconds or until it starts to ease off if it doesn't ease off or if you get pins and needles then you're probably on a nerve not a muscle so you'll need to find a new spot muscles should ease off so that's it do it on both sides and enjoy a bit of freedom in the pecs